As we continue to celebrate Black History, Dr. Mae Jemison is a first, but certainly not a last. That's right. Our meteorologist Andrew Kozak joining us now to share what it was like to sit down with the first Black woman to travel into space. I can't wait to see the story. It was incredible, Natasha Siafa. It's not every day you get to sit down with a pioneer and extraordinary fellow scientist. Dr. Mae Jemison was uh, has worn so many hats throughout her career, but she had, of course, to overcome many obstacles. And lift off of Blasting off into deep space. I'm just the first in a long line of African American women. The absolute thrill of going where so few have gone. But now so many follow the path paved by Dr. May Jemison, a pioneer. We believe pursuing an extraordinary tomorrow builds a better world today. But it wasn't an easy journey for the first African American female astronaut. See, back when she was just May, it was a time when careers in the sciences weren't encouraged for girls, let alone black girls. You know, with girls, it's like, don't get your clothes dirty. How can you explore the world and not get your clothes dirty? She challenged those notions. As a six-year-old, she was determined to become a scientist and recalls her teacher asking if she meant a nurse. I put my hands on my hip and I told the teacher, no, I mean a scientist. I wanted to include in 2023, after an extraordinary career with NASA, she acknowledges the progress being made in education, but says there's still a long way to go, especially for women and minorities. I'm worried about education because in some ways, I think our society does a lot of lip service to it, but we don't invest in it in the same way. As we celebrate black history, Dr. Jemison can now not only be considered a first in her field, but an inspiration to a new generation of space travel. With the upcoming Artemis mission set to launch in 2024, NASA will land its first female person of color on the moon. We have the full representation of our society, so the first woman of color, uh, the, first, the first woman in space, the first person of color. However they classify it, it means that we need to take advantage of our full range of talent. Dr. Jemison emphasizes because achievements like that don't come easy, black history should be honored year-round. Understand that these things aren't just figures that you use for this time and you do your report and you go away. They're as much a part of our world as any other history. And how about this for an accomplishment? Dr. Jemison is an official Lego. In 2017, she was included in the Women of NASA collector set. This trailblazer has her hands in everything. A medical career, writing and research for STEM, speaking engagements all over the world. Dr. Jemison looks forward to seeing even more women and minorities exploring the world beyond and wouldn't completely rule out suiting back up if called upon. And they could take older people too. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Dr. Jemison also spoke about how important it is for black girls to get involved with STEM at an early age. It's one of her many points that she shares in all her speeches. Natasha Siapa, it was incredible. My dad's a NASA ambassador, has been an astronomy professor for years, wow. and to be able to sit down and talk with a living legend like that, oh my absolutely gosh. incredible. She is such an inspiration and a trailblazer. Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing to see what we're going to do in the future and how many people are going to benefit from her trailblazing. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Great job, man. Thank you.